channel. Look who I have over for the holidays. Say hello. Hi. Hey guys, so my sister is over for the holidays. It's Christmas Eve. We've been having fun today. We went out to eat and now we're going to have a couple of drinks with y'all. She's going to tell y'all about these little chocolate covered thingies. Um, I did do a video on this, but she hasn't tasted any of them yet. And we're going to also do a trivia. We have Miss Nisha in the background over there. She's going to ask. <laughs> she's going to ask us some questions. And I guess we'll eat a chocolate if we get it wrong. That works. Okay. So she's going to ask us some questions. And we'll eat a chocolate if we get it wrong. You want to tell them what kind of chocolates we have? If I can get it out of the pack for you. We also have some Starbucks. We're also going to have us some Starbucks. Because we didn't know what to eat with this. Because we had literally, we just ate. So we didn't know what to um, pair this with. So, if we get them wrong, we will be having a shot of either Southern Comfort, Salsa, Contour, I believe that's the name, and Jim Bean. And the other person gets to pick which one they have to eat. All right, so Nisha... Why don't you go ahead and start with the first question. And these are on sale right now at Sam's, y'all. Okay, the first question is kind of easy. How are we going to do it? Is it whoever answers the question first? or like We can do whoever one? answers it first. Okay, this well, one's that's easy. The, what? No, no. There should be like some type of way to see who answers right. first. Have, like, we'll you have a coin? Answer. I don't have a coin. Wait, how would the coin work? Oh. I'm younger. I we need first. a buzzer. Okay, no, she can no, go I... first. She can go first. She can go first. I can't find the buzzers. We don't? Okay. What does R and B stand for? Options. Oh. A rock and blues. B rhythm and blues. C rock and bass. If I go first, why is your hand up? Okay, no. I think it should be to where whoever answers. No, but that's not fair because I knew the answer. I thought I didn't have to say nothing because I thought I was first. Girl, say the answer. <laughs> well, no, okay, let's do another one. Whoever put their hand up first gets to answer the question. Both of us know that one, so we can't do that one. Okay. And make sure it's something of our era. No, it could be any era. If you pick your hand up and you get it wrong, you got to chop. Okay, whatever. <laughs> when was the term R&B music first introduced? A, around the 1940s. B, around the 1950s. C, around the 1960s. C. You, you didn't put your hand, hand up. Oh. <laughs> yes, <that's laughs> no. Okay. <laughs> do I have to guess or do I have to uh, do she? Do I have to guess? Okay, what's the options? A, around the 1940s. B, around the 1950s. Or C, around the 1960s. I say B because she picked C and it was wrong. Both of y'all are wrong. Well, damn. I guess both of us got to take a shot. They have another question. Answer. A. A, around the 1940s. <laughs> okay, so I want her to taste this one. Answer. And which one do I have to take? I'm going to be easy on you. So, Southern Comfort. Okay. Y'all have to excuse my son. <laughs> the Ronalds are downstairs having fun right now. Oh, Meanwhile, this is a puzzle. Nisha, go get a, um, a wet towel, please. All they have here is help. I mean, it's on Lysol wipes. <laughs> Yeah, but I need this is sticky. Mm -hmm. Well, the alcohol probably is coming out a little. Here, let's put it on there. We can't see that. Yeah. All right, you want to eat it at the same time? No, because I won't laugh at you. I need to see you eat it. No, I tried this one. I actually like this one. But you don't drink. This alcohol. is my favorite. But this is my favorite one. Well, it's not that comfort good. Either. I gave the rest of them away to Amanda. <laughs> That's all right. When I leave, I'll take them home. <laughs> This one here, this is a first for me. I've tried everything else, I believe. You want to get chocolate on yourself? It's strong, huh? What in the world? Oh, wait. Oh, it didn't hit that little. It's <laughs> <laughs> not bad, though. Hmm? Okay. Next question. Next question. 
Which magazine created the term R&B for use in a marketing campaign? A. MTV B. Billboard C. Rolling Stone What the first one was you said? <laughs> MTV Okay, so they don't have a magazine, but Rolling Stones has a magazine. MTV don't have a magazine, right? Do MTV have a magazine? I, I plead the fifth. Oh, both of y'all say the answer. Okay, so what do you I think I didn't say the answer. I say, um, Rolling Stone. Rolling Stone? What do you say? She done made me forget what the options was. Which you know what? Yeah, both of us answer. And whichever one get it wrong, take a shot. That's better. Now what you say? I forgot the answers. Rolling Stone, MTV, and Billboard. And Billboard. You did not know this one. Well, shit. Is that right? I don't know that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to go. Wait, they got the magazine. So I'm going to go Rolling Stones. Both of y'all are wrong. It's Billboard. Billboard. Yeah. I figured that. Both of y'all charts. take it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but I didn't know they had a magazine. I didn't know they had a magazine, though. Really? But you didn't know you started the movie. Yeah, <laughs> that's the only reason I did Okay, know. so which one do you want for me to drink? I picked this one for you. Which one you... <laughs> Why you look at it like that? Because it's tequila. What? You gotta pick mine. Which one? Oh, Jim Bean. You looking at it the way she was looking at it. <laughs> I, 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 I gotta, and I don't have my glasses on. Oh, it's, that's a bird. Yeah, Jim Beam's bird. Y'all, they say I gotta start wearing my glasses all day. It's been like that, but my eyes are getting worse. You're gonna be blind with a mole still. <laughs> my glasses were so expensive, y'all. <laughs> I know that feeling. Even with insurance. <laughs> it's my fault. Once I get home, I take my glasses off. And I'll be perfectly fine. I let my eyes adjust to my scenery. So I made that a room, get a big TV in the room, so I don't have to worry about not being able to see it. And if okay, something comes up in my room, I hit pause on the TV and then I call Nisha and I'm going to ask her to read it to me. Do that I not, sounds, Nisha? That sounds like uh, the <laughs> movie. They, they be putting on the TV on text messages. What how you like used to. <laughs> There's, there are many memes. How you used to be wanting to fuss and cut up when your parents call you for the remote and the remote was like right, right. Not even two feet from them. You calling the child. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't call Nisha for the remote because I used to have the remote. Hey, they can call, call you and <laughs> she can't see it. I can't see. <laughs> Nisha, what that say? I'll be like this. I can't. Nisha. What that is? Oh, no, like if I'm trying to find a movie? movie? I'm about to use my teeth. Right. I couldn't That's even find a movie. That's a different language, Mom. <laughs> I'm about to use my teeth. We need to finish watching that movie. Yeah, we was that's oh you guys, if y'all haven't watched Woman King, is that the name Woman of Woman King? Yeah. Woman she King. Right. That is a really good movie. You guys, we watched that last night on Netflix. Mm -hmm. I saw that on no, 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 no. It was one of the maps. So I don't know the name of the map. Okay, I don't know. We watched it on just Google it. If the name of the movie is Woman King. We were supposed Redbox, to be watching Redbox, Avatar, but we couldn't find well it said Avatar. You can watch Avatar on Disney Plus. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Nisha. Mm -hmm. Gave me something to go do tonight. I need your, um... My love. Disney Plus? Uh-huh. Okay. Yeah, yeah. We want to watch the Disney Princess movie. I barely use it unless something is in the show. She keep asking me to get it. Yeah. I have it. Because I want to be able to watch it. I have Disney that. Movie. I paid 99 cents for it for Black Friday. Really? I got it for 99 cents for the rest of the year. Every month. Just the rest of the year? Mm-hmm. Well, how much is it oh. for the beginning of the year? No, no, no. I'm sorry. <laughs> for 12 months. Is that deal still going on? No, it was for Black Friday only. Well, if you pay 99 cents, I'm going to give you 50 cents a month. <laughs> We're going to go half price. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Not bad. I ain't driving, so I don't care. So ready for the next question? No, I'm going to have to drive you home. Probably make it pick it up. Y'all, I have a new drink. That's not a wine. It's called Twisted Tea. It is so good. It don't taste like liquor in it, but it make you feel like you're walking on air. I like it. A wine cooler will make you feel like you're walking on air. Well, that's because I'm, I'm not a drinker, but that drink tastes very good. I only had one of them, and I was feeling so good. She graduated from wine. I like those, y'all. But for a 12-pack, was it a 12-pack? What I got? It was a 6 or a 12 I don't know, but that was $20. I was like a 12 Felicia, alcohol is not cheap. <laughs> Ronald usually buy mine when I was when he rung That's it why up. She don't know the price. <laughs> when he rung it up, I was like, "Okay, should I get this or should I not?" 
Oh no, I wanted it because I couldn't find this it. This what your thoughts were. Should I get this or should I not? Should I just send daddy room back? Oh, okay, so I was. I was gonna send him to the store. I know. But they literally didn't have he had to find that for me. Oh hell yeah, you were about He had to find that for me. One girl was telling me, just go to the liquor store, ma'am. She looked like she was about 18 or 19 years old. I'm not saying nothing about going to the liquor, liquor store because the liquor store not right here on the corner by you, but down the street by you. I walk in there and ever since the pandemic, the man is like, you you get wine? You get wine? I got your wine behind the counter. I was like, oh. Everybody at work brought me wine for Christmas almost. But that's that 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 there, the people in the, the store. The I have. Store. Okay, Carla, if you're watching this, I'm ready for my, um, my 1K, you guys. Share this video out. I need y'all to share it out to everybody. Y'all know we got to get to that 1K before the first. We giving away $100 at on the 31st, I said. On the 31st, 31st. Well, on the 1st at midnight if I'm woke. If I'm not woke, we'll just do it on the first when I wake up. Do it on the first when you wake up because I'm going to be too intoxicated to participate. You ain't going to participate. Oh. It's just the um, I'm giving away the money. Oh, I was about to say you that. need to look at my damn video. If you look at the video, when I gotta look at the video, because it, the video been it. up. Oh, okay, I'll go look at it. <laughs> hey, go back, y'all, y'all go. I'm gonna put the link for that video in the description box below. I need she gonna do it. She gonna put it in the description box below. Y'all join for the fifty dollar giveaway. I'm doing two fifty dollar giveaways, totaling up for a hundred dollars for the New Year's. Y'all holler at your girl. All right, what's the next question? You should come on. <laughs> And what else? No. Did he go to sleep? No, she went to sleep. What is the first album of Destiny's Child? A. Destiny's Child. B. A Days of Christmas. C. The Writings on the Wall. Okay. Is it my turn or her turn? Both of y'all. Whichever one you want. What's A and C? The Writings on the Wall. A and C. What's A? Destiny's Child and C is The Writings on the Wall. I'm going to say The Writings on the Wall. Writings on the Wall. It's A or C. Yeah, which one you want? <laughs> okay. Destiny's Child. Mommy, you finally got one right. <laughs> <laughs> then she gonna throw it at me. Why you keep giving me Patron? That don't say Patron. You said that was vodka. No, I didn't. That is Pat uh, not Patron. Well, technically Patron. It's tequila I'm trying to say. Well, I don't have no glasses on. What's the difference? You want something else? No, I'm going to drink. I mean, you already picked it. it. <laughs> you can't change it once it's been picked. Okay, so we, you want to, um, we cook with bourbon, so I didn't want to give you that. Thank oh, no, I, I drink cook. I mean, I drink, I drink that too. Isn't, is, is, isn't this, well, not this one, the the um other one, when I make the rum balls and the rum cake? Mm -hmm. I don't make it with Jim Beam, but it's still a bourbon. Yeah, I can't see this. Does it burn your throat when it goes down? Look at that. See, you just, my daughter right there. <laughs> <laughs> mm -mm. Tell you, y'all gotta watch how y'all ask questions because I look and be like, say, why not? Ain't, right. Ain't nothing going down my throat, so I wouldn't Ain't nothing going down. Ugh, and then you talking about that and that being all. <laughs> 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 you got answers, <laughs> <your shit>, bro. <laughs> Right now, <laughs> we only got the three damn questions. Ask us another question. You ask Lachi. The famous what? hit. Ask the question. <laughs> the famous hit "Do Whoop That Thing" by Lauren Hill was first introduced in which decade? Can you sing that song? I didn't hear what she said. I don't know the song. Bro. What's what she said? What's the name of the song? Do it's Lauren Hill. Do whoop. Do whoop. Da whoop. <laughs> what song is she talking about? My Lauren Hill. Hill. I can't think of the lyrics. I like Lauren Hill. I used to have. You know that song. That's yeah, my I used to have one. all of her CDs. Okay. Uh, well, which decade was it introduced? Okay. A, the 1980s. B, the 1990s. C, the 2000s. 90s. 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 Yeah, 90s. 90s. Yeah, that was better. Right. I know we do. <laughs> <laughs> Which part of Rihanna's body was insured for one million dollars? A. Hands. B. Shoulders. Endorsed. Insured. Insured. Okay. I N S U R E D. Okay. If that helps. <laughs> if that helps. <laughs> if that helps. <laughs> okay. 
A, hands, B, shoulders, or C, legs? Legs. What's the other option? Shoulders. Shoulders and hands. Hands. Legs. Because she danced. Oh, she She just got thick legs after having her baby. No. Her legs got in short because she danced. She doesn't just, she danced. Like, you don't remember insured, umbrella like, and everything when she, she, she like, danced. I guess if something happened to them, she gonna get paid. That's what I'm saying, yeah. Yeah. You gotta Next pick question. one for her. You gotta pick one for me. I'm oh. looking at you like. I'm giving you a tequila now. These burn my inside. I bet they do. <laughs> That's why I was trying to give you all of them, so I ain't gotta take them. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was trying to. I was trying to give. Oh my god. They all like that. You starting to melt. No, I can't open them. Not the melt. Open it from the bottom. Yeah, I couldn't find the um the seal to open it. That's why. I Mm, I had to yeah, it wasn't leaking. Oh, now it's leaking. I hope you guys are enjoying y'all Christmas Eve. And I hope y'all ready to spend Christmas tomorrow with y'all family members. Excuse me. Sorry, y'all. It cut off on us. <laughs> What's the question? In which year was the first album of Alicia Keys' Song in the Mirror released? The phone turned off. A, 1995. B, 2001. C, 2003. What the option is? <laughs> a, a, 1995. B, 2001. What's C, 2003. In which year was the it's first album be, of Alicia Keys' Song in the Mirror so. released? Song in the Mirror? What album was that? That is the album, I believe. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. What, what number? What you mean? What you mean? That'll help me because I know when she started, when she came out. 2001 and 2003, right? Yeah, 2001, 2003, and 1995. No, 95. it ain't going to be 95. It ain't going to be 95. What are the years? 2001 and 2003. 2001. 2001. Yeah, it will have to be 2001 if it's not. What's the other option? 2003. 2000 like 2000, 2003, 2001, and 1995. It ain't 95. Who the actress is in? I mean, act whoever it is. Alicia Keys. It ain't 95. You were just going into junior high. About to. What's the year? 2001, 2003, and 1993. It gotta be 2001. It'd be 2001. Mm -hmm. Okay. Which R&B group is known for begging in their music? A. Keith Sweat. Keith Sweat. Ah! Wait, stop, 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 stop. She said R&B group. You did say group. Yeah. Okay, okay. he's not a group. He's not going. <laughs> What's that? Wait, 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 wait. It is. You shouldn't have said nothing. You could have. <laughs> B. <laughs> B. Boys and two men. Boys to men. Or C. Tony, Tony, Tony. I'm going to go with. I'm down on my knees. Begging you, please. Boys to men. Tony, Tony, Tony. Keith Sweat. Keith Sweat's not a group. He's not a group. It's, 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 you got to change yeah. that question. Because he's not a he's group. He's not a group. If he, you would have said is. LSG, I would say yeah. He is the beggar, but he's not a group. Yeah, cause But yeah, boys well, the men did the big, and that was the only group I remember big. All on big. No, I don't remember Tony, Tony, Tony big. It's our anniversary, and I don't, I'm trying to think of these songs, but boys the men big. Which R&B group was founded by Michael Bivens, the former member of New Edition? A, boys, boys to Men, B, Drew Hill, or C, After Seven? Ooh. I know the answer. Are you serious? We watched the, um, there was a new edition. Ah, uh, ah. No, yeah. I know. No, you do know. <laughs> wow. Really <laughs> obvious answer. Boys to Men. What's the answer? Boys to Men. Yeah, it's Boys to Men. Mm. They show it in the movie. Yeah, yeah in the movie. Because like, we were waiting for you to answer. They they yeah, it was Boys to Men. 
Which of the following songs was featured in the soundtrack of the movie Poetic Justice? A. That's the way love goes. B. Again. C. I'll make love to you. What's the what's 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 the song? I mean, what's the justice. poetic justice with Janet Jackson, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, two questions. Now, what's the songs? A. That's the way love goes. B. Again. C. Again. I'll make love to you. Again. That's right. Thank you. I'm thinking again too. Again. Yeah, it's again. Which of the following was a hit song in 1990 by Whitney Houston? A. I have nothing. B. I'm your baby tonight. C. Miracle. I have nothing. I have nothing. I'm your baby tonight is the answer. What did you say? I'm your baby tonight. No, what year? Whitney sang all of them. 1990. I know that. In 1990? Mm Mm-hmm. I thought I'm your baby tonight was like 89, 88. I don't know, but I ain't drinking no more. That thing burnt me. Take my shot, too. (laughs) I think not. I'm going to go Southern Comfort, though. You can go on with the questions. Oh. What is another name of R&B these days? A. Come here, I need you to take my shot! A. (laughs) Contemporary R&B. B. Modern R&B. Or C. Classical R&B. What's the option? What's the question? What was the question? What is another name of R&B these days? Okay, now what's the option? Well, I must them all. A, contemporary R&B. B, modern R&B. Modern. B, classic R&B. Can you sit modern. here for a minute and take my shot? Modern. Please. Modern. Come, yo, what's your answer? What's your answer? Mommy. I'm modern. Modern, modern? Come on. Contemporary R&B. Just How about the tape that they use them all? <laughs> you have to do two actually, because she got two wrong. Oh no! Come on, just one. Okay, well, you can just do one. They want to see you. They want to see you. Yeah. They said that. Yes, they did say it. Come on, come on. Be a true sport. Unless my stomach hurts. Come on, pull your stomach. Come on, yeah. See, see, see. Daddy, you got to sit down. They gotta see you. I'm gonna take you this. Open it and eat it. So, Daddy, bro, I'm gonna take my shot. Look at the people. Tell them, hey. Hey, y'all. Uh, I'm not taking this hit. I'm not taking no one's stop. Yes, I am. Daddy! Shh! <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, I can't take this. Mm-hmm. Dad, just turn your mouth. Put it right there. Hurry up, Dad. Just take it oh, off. Come on, come on, come on. There you come. You come. That's it. I'm coming, my dog. What you supposed to eat this at? The bottom? Just, the whole thing. Just, just bite the just whole bite thing. Just bite the bottom. No, you, you gotta bite it, man. Hurry up and do it like you're gonna shot. Before you mess the thing up. Then you have to bite it. I don't like this. <laughs> you still have to bite it. I don't. I don't have to. Yeah, huh? Hey, you don't like that. 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 You don't You don't like that. 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 You with you. That's why okay. you try this one or this one. That's the ones I like. Southern Company, you can mix with I, it. I don't want any of those because I don't want to say anything. Yucky baby. But that's it. I'm not a yucky baby. I'm not a yucky baby. I'm not a yucky baby. Get out, get out, get out. You hit the camera. <laughs> you don't have to be kidding. Hey, y'all, we back. <laughs> we had to take a brief inter. Yeah, the Ronald stepped in for a minute. <laughs> I don't want to take no more shots, but I'll answer the questions. I'm done with shots. I didn't took enough. Which? I took all my. She didn't take all hers. Nope, sure didn't. She punked out. Sure did. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't in denial. I quit. <laughs> Come on, we'll do two more questions for y'all, and then we'll end the video. Oh, I want to 
for Wonder Woman. Brittany. I don't know. <laughs> Both of us kind of got that the same. Um, you, should, you can take this on. Okay. <laughs> As I bring a new year in. At the beginning around the 1950s, R&B music was mainly associated with which group? A. Black youth. B. Black adults. Or C. Black elders. Black adults. What was that again? At the beginning around 1950s, R&B music was mainly associated with which group? A. Black youth. B. Black adults. C. Black elders. Youth. Youth? It's youth. Well, guess All them people were young. I wasn't thought of in the 50s. I wasn't thought of either. But they were, <laughs> they were young. Coming out of the church. What else? Your nephew? He probably playing bottles with it on the stairs. Or throwing a ball up the stairs and watching it bounce down the stairs. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> you like it? I love it. The dis discography, the discography, disco plus graphy, discography, okay. of which artist features the most, the world's most famous equation, E equals MC squared. A, Whitney Houston, B, Alicia Keys, C, Mariah Carey. Mariah Carey. I just say Mariah. Who do people listen again? <laughs> Whitney Houston, Alicia Keys, and Mariah Carey. Whitney Houston. Mariah, Mariah Carey. Carey. When I say her the first time, I switched to Whitney. And I still stick with Whitney. Mariah mm -hmm. Carey actually had a, uh, I know that from an album. Well, guess what? I'm not good at math. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> so, I'm about she was asking me about equations and yeah, stuff. Yeah, the CD. <laughs> and I thought I was the Yeah, the, 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 the album was MC... What For real? Free Square or something yeah. like that? Y'all yeah. serious? Yeah. Yeah, I ain't know that. I think that album came out after the Honey album. I had the Honey album. Exactly. Remember? I think it came out after that one. I had all her albums except for probably like her last two or three. I want to go date what her last two or three is. I actually still have a lot of my CDs. Yeah. They're I have a book. Mm -hmm. uh, I have a book. I, I, so I, have, I have like two CD books in the closet right The only there. reason I have, well, I have books because of Lonnie Daddy. You took that man books. No, I didn't. Yes, that was did. the ones he gave to me. You took that man CD. No, he burnt them so he would have his own. You took that man CD. No, he burnt them so he would have his own. He got tired of me asking for them, so he finally so just. So you took that man CD. No, he finally gave it to me. He said, I, "He said it. I'm tired of Do you." Do he still burn CDs? He has the machine still. He has that. He still has some of his mixing boards. He still has some. He has the turntable still with the booty on. He still be um DJing. He'll go and help his brother out every now and then, but no, not really. Um, All right, you guys. I want you to have a merry, merry Christmas. Thank you guys so, so very much for spending time with me and my sister today. Hopefully, y'all get another video out of us because we were supposed to be reviewing a certain place that neither one of us ever had. But we wound up going out to eat and didn't get the review. So, hopefully, we get that review to you guys before the New Year's. I love well, before the New Year's. You say it won't be? All right, you guys, it cut us off. So I love y'all so, so very much. Mwah, mwah, mwah. And as always.